So here is the completed diamond painting, the special gem Cheshire Cat. I think it took me about two hours. I was trying to keep track of the time. I started on it uh, like Friday morning for about 20 minutes and Friday afternoon for about another 20 minutes and then today I did about maybe an hour, a little over an hour. So maybe two hours, a little over two hours. The most uh, painstaking part was these little red gems right here. These ones. So all in all, it turned out pretty well. It still has kind of a crease in it. And there was plenty of gems left over. Now with these special gems, uh, you use quite a bit of wax. So this is the wax. <clears throat> it's pretty chewed up. I would suggest to the company, maybe with the special gems, to, um, <clears throat> excuse me, maybe give a bigger piece of wax. Because I, I have to, a lot of wax from other kits, but if you're a beginner... You might use more wax than this even but that's just how it is when you use these uh, special kind of gems they're just a little harder to pick up and you end up reloading the pen quite a bit so one word of caution I had taken the plastic cover off of the whole thing the plastic that covers it now believe it or not there is a wrong and a right way to put this back on if you want to put it back on. If you put it on the wrong way, it's going to stick to the glue and be impossible to get off. So I would keep it on and just fold it back. Or if you take it off, i use something like these kind of parchment papers to cover it up. But for the most part, after I took all that plastic off, I ended up keeping it uncovered and the glue was fine. And then afterwards, um, I took some nail polish remover I had heard that you can get the printing off on the side so I started a little bit with the q-tip I'm gonna finish taking that off you just have to be careful not to get it on the design ink because this is a partial so a lot of this is printed and there's only certain parts where the diamonds go the eyes are printed the mouth is printed so I'm going to try to finish taking the ink off of it, and I will hang it up somewhere. And I didn't need my light pad today because I have a lot of light coming in. When I first started working on it, it was pretty dim in here, so I ended up having to use the light pad with it. So that's it. That's my review. Uh, probably a little over two hours, and I didn't have really any issues besides that crease, which I'm still going to put uh, uh, like a book or something over this to flatten it more. I'm going to finish taking the ink off of the sides, and then I'll hang it up. So again, that was under the $4 section, and it was... $3.43. I like this one too, this owl. That's pretty neat. Alright, so that's my review.